Yo, what's up guys? I'm super super happy to be back here on YouTube again. For all of you who didn't know, I had a lot of internet issues in the past weeks and we were finally finally able to get rid of them. Um, yeah, today I have something very special, which is we are facing the two times Japan national champion and the world's finalist of last year, Hirofumi Kimura. I hope I pronounced that one right. Uh, he's just an incredibly talented player, one of my personal favorite players of the last couple of years. Um, it was such a big honor to play him and yeah, I reached out to him because I needed some preparation for Players Cup 2 which is happening next weekend uh, and I wanted to feel confident in my play so I challenged him, he immediately accepted and the match was just an amazing set. Hope you will like it as, uh, as well. And yeah, if you want to see me play another player, maybe your personal favorite player, feel free to uh, comment uh, their name in the comments and I will just try my best to get them on the channel as well. Um, yeah, one last thing I wanted to mention is I streamed that match on Twitch, so feel free to follow my Twitch channel as well. And we finally have a Discord server, so if you're looking for a place to hang around, um, talk about Pokemon, get access to my teams, feel free to uh, join the server. And yeah, hope you will enjoy the match. Um, yeah, take care everyone. Uh, love you all. Bye bye. I'm bringing this team, which I really really like, and yeah, let's see. I have my notebook as well. So I can, uh, because I'm taking this super serious. So let's see, it's actually the first time I'm playing him in a best of three. I played him a couple times on ladder. But let's see. Okay, there is Zapdos. Okay, Lando, Cresselia, Heatron. Oh wow, he's playing Primarina and Kartan. Okay, so it's actually the first Primarina I saw. Uh, I see. So uh, since uh, Finny's there, I thought people are not bringing uh, or not playing Primarina anymore, but let's see. I like Rigaliki a lot here. Dragapult is also fine. I'm not gonna lie. The thing is, do I want an offensive approach or a defensive approach? Like, I could just lead Dusclops Rigaliki, set some screens, and Trick Room, and then try to win uh, from the back with the Ice Horse. Mm, that's probably what I'm gonna do, game one. Yeah. And instant for Cortana. Mm, yeah, I have to be careful though. Let's see. So excited. I think he's leading Cresselia just because it, there's no um, downside in doing so. Let's see. Okay, there's Cresselia and Primarina. All right. And there's Duskops. Okay, I'm seeing the items, Colbor and Life Orb, which is cool. Colbor and Life Orb. Alright, so what I could do is just set Trick Room immediately, but then Rigaliki would be uh, the fastest Pokemon, uh, the slowest Pokemon in Trick Room. Mm. I think what I want to do is just Nightshade to get some chip off and set the light screen. I'm not thinking, I mean, Rigaliki might go down, to be honest. Okay, he's with this drawing. Cresselia for Lando. Okay, he probably thinks that I'm gonna go for a uh, Volt Switch, so he wanted to catch me there. So he brought Lando, Cresselia, and Primarina. And he's just protecting, okay, so... This is basically a free turn for us. Uh, we take no damage and set the light screen, and he... Um, yeah, loses some of his HP. Let's see. Um, what I can do now is Volt Switch. But he could read that and just go for Max Quake or... Yeah, the thing is, the thing I don't like about Rigaliki uh, paired with, um, for example, Instant is because is that they share the same weakness with, uh, uh, what is ground? So, I think setting Trick Room is fine though. And Reflect. If he knocks me out, he knocks me out. And then I'm just bringing in my Ice Horse and we'll be in a good position. Okay, he's switching Primarina out. Into Crystal. Okay, he's probably Earthquaking, but my Rigal Legal live th uh, lives that, unless he's Choice Band. Thanks, guys. 
U-Turns, okay. Choice Band. Has to be Choice Band. Mm. Oh wait, did I set a screen? Yes, okay. So I I'm pretty sure it's Choice Band. But I'm still doing a question mark. Okay, so now he's in Trick Room. Um, he could reverse Trick Room as well. Mm -mm. Kind of Nightshade, the Chrysalia, and Volt Switch. If he lets me Volt Switch, that's fine. If not, it's still okay. The thing is, I'm gonna Volt Switch um, as the last thing. I'm the fastest Pokemon without Trick Room. So, whatever comes in will take no damage. He maxes finally. There's Primarina. Still have to be careful. Like, I have screens up, but life up and with helping hand. Okay, he's probably going after Dusclops here. He should be going after Dusclops, but I have light screen off, so I should take it. Let's see. Oh, he's just targeting down really leaky, okay. Okay, so I'm worried that he's that he has um, ally switch. So normally I would go for a ground type move with my ice horse. But if he has, if he goes for ally switch, I'm uh, in a terrible spot. Mm -hmm. What he could do as well is just reverse trick room and go for max guard here. Or I could just target down Cresselia here, which I want to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nightshade. And Hailstorm. That should pick up the KO. Let's see. And the good thing is I'm changing weather as well here. So he won't get the rain boost anymore. And if I get the knockout here on Cresselia, we are in a phenomenal position. Let's go Ice Horse. Okay, no max card, but that's fine. Please no citrus. Okay, we don't even proc it. So let's see if we get a KO. I mean, we should. Oh, it hangs on. It's probably bold then. But Hale might just pick up the KO. Ah, no, he's changing the weather again with um, Geyser, yeah. Okay, so let's see if he's reversing Trick Room into Ice Horse. Okay, we take that pretty well. And he's probably just reversing Trick Room. Yeah. So I wonder if I'm in the Helping Hand Max Geyser range. I'm still at full HP and I still have Light Screen up. But he has Helping Hand and is in rain. Mm. I, yeah, I should go down to Helping Hand. I'm pretty sure. So what I'm gonna do here... He sh ah, I mean we are talking about, in my opinion, the best play in the world. So he would make a read here, I think. And, going, and would go after Dusclops. Mm. Yeah, if he reads me there, good game. Yeah, he goes, there's the helping hand. See if he decides to go after Dusclops or Ice Horse. Okay, so we get that right, which is uh, probably game deciding. If, if he just um, killed my Dusclops there, I would have lost instantly, I think. But right now I still have one max turn. 
Nightshade. Mm. Do I go for Steel Spike? What does he have in the back? Probably. Uh, we saw Landris. And it could be Kartana. Looking at my team. What do I have against Kartana? I have Incinero, so I want to change the weather as well. So that he loses his uh, potential Sash on Kartana. But uh, then again. I'd go for Steel Spike as well. Just to make my Dust Globs even bulkier. But nah, uh, let's do this. He might go for Ally Switch as, uh, as well, if he has it. Okay, there's a switch out, which is good. Into Landorus, okay. That's perfectly fine. Yeah, okay, we get rid of Landorus. This is huge. Let me write in the most we saw helping hand. We saw trick room. We saw U-turn on Landorus. Geyser. Which should be a hydro cannon. There's our beast boost. Okay, this is looking pretty good now. We still have like three turns of trick room left as well. There's Primarina. And Kartana, okay. So we are out of max. But that's fine. So, bad thing is we have to take care of Primarina with um, our horse. Let's see. I don't want to nightshade this guy. I mean, I still have instant, so I'm super fine. But what if he swore stands in, in my face? Let's see, I'm just gonna do this. And I want to protect here. Yeah. Uh. Protect, just to see what he's gonna do. Okay, he protects Kartana. So probably just gonna go for something like Hydro Cannon. Yeah, perfect. I'm neutral, right? Yeah. So I kind of wish I had a fighting type move on Glass Tree, but can't have everything. I mean, I still have Insin. Nightshade. Mm, could heavy slam. But he he's probably protecting here, which he should. Two turns left, okay. Yeah, let's have his time. He's protecting, but I can do the same next turn as well. Oh, he double protects! He probably thinks that I'm a fighting type move, which is super good for me. And Perunu should go down. Awesome. Yeah, that's game one. And what I'm gonna do now... Since he can't protect now... I'm just gonna switch an Ensign. In case he protects, and then I have... Guaranteed Fake Out Pressure. Unless he goes for... Um, unless he goes for... Uh, for double protect. Why spear over crash? I don't want to miss my moves. And I think ice skills uh, crash is still strong. Like look at how much it does uh, to a Kartana. 
Yeah, there are three hits. Like, worst case, I get... Um, and I can crit every single move. And yeah, like 90% is just too shaky for me. Okay, so... Game one. Okay, let's see how he's gonna ju uh, just... Oh god, my he my heart is racing so hard, uh, fast right now. What I could see him doing now... Uh, he could do the same lead, or he could go Kartana and try to uh, sweep from there. I kind of want to go Dragapult, but what if he goes Primarina and um, Cresselli again? That would be terrible. So I want to do the same lead. Yeah, no matter what he brings, I should still be fine, I think. Like, my only concern is Kartana. I would love to bring Dragapult here, but I just can't against Primarina. Yeah. Let's see. I probably, like, I think it's probably the same lead now. Just because it gives him the most, uh, most of the team as well, uh, like, most out of it as well. Oh, no. No Chrysalia. Which is kind of sad. But it's still fine. There's Intimidate. Okay, so, he has a couple options now. We see Assault Vest. Okay. All right. I thought it's choice bent. Um. The thing is, he could just protect Primarina here and trap me, so I can't volt switch. But he saw that I'm screens, so would he do that? He could just knock off and max guys as well into dust clubs. That could pick up the KO. So I think I'm gonna light screen. And trick room. I mean, if he knocks me out, he knocks me out. Yeah. I'm pretty sure knock off. Okay, yeah, he wanted to trap me, but I should still take earthquake here. Pretty sure. Thanks for the host, Bertigo. Yeah, I wanna see his face now. Unless he crits me. Was that a crit? No crit? Dude, I cocked that. Oh wow, but it's better for me. Because I get the ice horse in now. But I really thought I, I'm gonna live that. It's probably adamant then. Hmm... Yeah, let's go Glastria. I mean, I have Trick Room up. I lost Rig Leaky, but I still set up my light screen, so it's it's fine. So what I have to do now is basically get the turns right. Like we know it's Assault Vest, so he's like he can't switch. Like what is his Ice Resist? I mean Heatran, but it's still gonna take a lot of damage. Let's go. <laughs> Yeah, Alex, I think he got a roll there. It has to be one. Just gonna paint split. Whatever comes in. Lando comes out. He's He just wants to preserve Intimidate. There's Cresselli, okay. Is he maxing as well? I wonder. He maxes, okay. I mean, he has to max. If he's not maxing and I target down um, Primarina, he's uh, probably just losing it there. But the good thing is I, s I set my light screen, so I'm safe. I mean, he can still crit me, but... 
Pain splits. I should be back at full health now. Yeah. Hailstorm. Okay. I mean, it's Cobble Berry, so that's also super good for us that no berries proccing here. There's Max Geyser. Okay. I'm really scared of Ally Switch. I'm really, really scared of Ally Switch. Like, I, I would love to go for Max... Um, I don't know if Cresselia has a Nightshade range. Probably not. So why not make it safe? Heal Storm again. And ooh, if he ally switches and I pain split into Cresselia, I might just lose. Oh god. Wait, we saw Helping Hand. We saw Trick Room. Oh god, I, I really don't want to run into ally switch. There it is! If I just uh, pain split it there, I would have lost. Because Dust Cops goes down. And that's still solid damage. There's Geyser. Okay. Oh. turns left oh that's bad that's bad Let's see if I get the knockout here. I don't. Okay. The good thing is if... I don't think there is a good thing here. Like even if Duskop uh, survives, um, Kartana will just come in next turn. There's Geyser. Mm. To those gloves, does not hang on here. And now we have only instant left. Landris sh should come in our Kartana. Yeah, Kartana. And we are out of max as well, which is uh, really bad. So all he has to do now is double protect. And then this will go to game 3. He could switch Cortana out as well, but he knows I could Icicle or Spear that slot. Even if I get the knockout here, if he switches in Landers, let's see. 
Like, there's no way Kartar is not protecting here. He should just make it safe and double protect. Yeah. But yeah, this is basically lost. Unless he misclicks or something. No trick room anymore. Do we go for Icicle Spear? I mean, he could miss, right? He just wants a neutral Cortana, so that he uh, can clean up both of my months. So if he misses Hydro Cannon, he might still have a little chance. There's the Flare Blitz. Connects, okay. GG. I still want to see his last move, if he has um, sword sense. I mean, we're not gonna see sword sense, but I want to see if he has. Um, that's so much. Uh, if he has um, smart strike or not. But I think this time. Let's let me see. He picked Cartana again. Primarina again, Cresselia again, and Lando again. So he just swapped out. Um, no, he didn't swap out anything. Yeah, he just changed up leads. Let's see if he's gonna show me Smart Strike. Yeah, okay, good to know. Actually, hang on. But yeah, I will faint from the Life of Recoil. <laughs> the boost's still coming. Okay. I wonder if he will Hi, ah, there's no way he would lead the same, right? I mean he could. I wanna bring Dragapult here. Just because I hate Chrysalia. Dragapult, um Regaliki. Duskos and probably Ice Horse. Do I need Incineroar? Incineroar hard loses to... I mean I have late game fake out which is very valuable but... Primaria, Primaria just uh, destroys me if I lose Regaliki. And Ice Horse is not doing enough. Yeah, let's go Dragapult mode here. And the thing is he has no Ghost Resist as well which is really tempting for me to do. Dusclops or Incin? Let's still go instant. Yeah. Let's see. Okay, so what would be really bad is if he leads Cresselia and Primarina, which I can see him doing that. Because it's pretty obvious that I'm probably going for the Dragapult road here. Oh, never mind. He goes for the same lead. Okay. And the thing is, Dragon Ball is the fastest mod on the field as well. So I don't even need to go for airstreams. We can just Phantasm. I could double the Primarina just to bring it in uh, in range of anything. Mm, no, I'm not gonna double it. I need light screen off. Otherwise, Dragapult is gonna die. No, 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 I'm not gonna time out. And light screen. Let's see. He has to max here as well.
There's a max. So the thing is, Lando's probably not going for Earthquake just because Primarina is maxing here. Mm, what would be bad is a uh, knockoff with um, with a max Starfall. There is a light screen. Phantasm. Solid two hit. U turn, okay. Probably into Cresselia. And thing is, is he activating my uh, weakness policy or not? I mean, he probably knows that I'm weakness policy. Because it makes so much sense. So let's see if he's going after Rigaliki. Yeah. Oh, and Dragapult. Okay. So basically what we have to do here is uh, call a ally switch or not. Mm. Things do I do the trade here? Am I okay? Am I fine with the trade? I don't think so. Like trading Dragapult for Cresselia is probably not gonna help me out too much. Just because Primurnus will still be around. But the other thing is, if I I mean if he max guards here and I go into Cresselia, he loses the match. So he has to attack. I think he has to attack. Max Phantasm. If he's not attacking. GG. That's so important, guys. I mean, for him, not even for him, like for anyone else, it would be so super obvious for me to try to, uh, try to go for the Trick Room Setter, but the risk for him is too, too big if I just ignore his uh, Primarina. And do we bring an Ice Horse? Yeah, I still want to Intimidate in the back. And he could still set up Trick Room for us. Let's go. Wait. Did it survive? I'm blind. Okay, no. Oh. And he sets trickle for us. Perfect. We still have all of our mounts, which is uh, super good. Like last game? We lost because we lost Rigaliki for, for a screen. And then we only had three months left without anything against Primarina. There's Cartana. I mean, Dragon Ball is still in a uh, phenomenal position here. So do we just max Phantasm? And we have Instant as well. And just go for Icicle Spear. What I could do, what is probably better, Phantasm. And go into instant. Like there's no way you sacred sword. Oh, or smart strike. Let's see. If he has ice beam, I think we still tank ice beam. Like Cresselia is one of if not nah not the weakest Pokemon, but it's super weak. Smart strike. We take it, perfect. And Cresselia goes down. Okay, this is looking phenomenal. Like, we still have all of our mons. Um, fake out pressure now. And Lando's coming in. There's Lando's. So 
So what I'm gonna do now is just switch out Dragapult. Just because. Three turns left. And how many turns of Misty Train? Two. So in the late game I will just be able to go for Dragon Darts. And clean it from there. Go into Glass Trier and... Just fake out. Yeah, to make sure he's not gonna do a crazy read. Yeah. Protect. Well, that's super fine. I mean, he could still crit, but... Even if he crits me, I don't think it's too bad. I mean, yeah, I need Ensign. I need Ensign. Ooh, that did so much. But I still have Rigaliki, so... Cortana's probably Sash. So I'm just free to go for Icicle Spear here and... Flavlets. Okay. Beast boost. Well, let's let's see if it's sash. We didn't see the item. Okay, there is a sash. Serried sword. Okay. Uh, yeah, I don't see how we're gonna lose this from here. Miss disappeared. I just bring in Dragapult here. Go for Protect, Trick will be over and then it's GG. I mean, this guy, this game was so close. Like, I mean, it's looking easy now. Like 3-0 probably. But like that one turn, if I get that wrong, we instantly lose. And that's, that's the game we play. And, yeah, drink dots. GG. Oh god, that was phenomenal set. I love playing uh, against uh, the best in the world. It's just, it's just a different feeling. GG. Oh wow, that was... That was so good. I should do more of these. I should really do more of these. Yeah, the the horse is uh, super good. The horse is amazing. Like I was, I was actually preserving this team for uh, other tournaments, but I was like, look, when I, like when else am am I getting this chance of playing? In my opinion, the best player in the world. And uh, I will. I just wanted to go all in. like all in. Can you explain uh, why Icicle Spear? Uh, I don't want to miss Icicle Crash. And with Icicle Spear, I still get like guaranteed 50 base ball off, which is fine. And yeah, 90% is just too shaky for me. Thanks again for tuning in, guys. I hope I could um, meet your expectations with the game against Hirofumi. And yeah, just thank you all for the support. Um, feel free to... Check out my YouTube, join the Discord. Um, if you don't follow the channel already, I would appreciate if you could do that as well. And yeah, just thank you for making my day every time and see you all. Bye bye.